actually allow for more radiational cooling to happen. That means our temperatures, they tumble and they do that pretty quickly. And I'm looking at Thursday morning as the coolest morning Philadelphia has had since May 13th as temperatures for the city will be in the 40s. I think we start Thursday morning in the upper 40s. Average as this time of the year is back in the low 50s. So it's more of a reality check. It's not like something crazy is going to happen and temperatures fall close to freezing. That's not it. But I think for everyone, it's an area of high pressure kind of slowly pivots from Canada down through the Ohio River Valley. We've got 40s widespread and a lot of you did the 40s this morning. So that's nothing new, but it is new for Philadelphia as of at least this season. A few 30s can't even be ruled out. Late week, they're talking about some patchy frost potential up near the Poconos, and that's something we're keeping an eye on. But we've got a plentiful array of blue skies and sunshine as that sun just beams off of the center city skyline. 65 degrees out the door, but that's still about 10 degrees cooler than and this time yesterday, as we had that cold front move on through, we've got that northerly breeze. So it's refreshing outside up and down the I-95 corridor. Temperatures around the mid 60s if you are headed up even further to uh, New York City as the fills obviously take on the Mets today. Temperatures at this hour in the low 60s. Same thing in Allentown, a little bit warmer through South Jersey as Millville and Tabernacle have now risen to 67 degrees and I think through the afternoon I think you're gonna like it it's plenty of time for you to be outside enjoying the forecast maybe opening up the windows letting some of that fresh air in through the Lehigh Valley the upper 60s for the city around 70 degrees that's seasonable for this time of the year and down the shore I think you wind up in the upper 60s as well through the overnight temperatures do fall just not as far as they will by Thursday morning for Philadelphia down to 50 tonight 44 in Allentown same thing in Lancaster and 46 in Pomona High pressure still in control for us. You see a little wet weather off of the lakes. So lake effects through uh, Ohio, even some of the upstate New York areas when it comes to wet weather. No snowfall, just rainfall for them. But we get a morning chill as we keep with that northerly breeze. The call for Mackey weather tomorrow, still 70 degrees. So if you like today, there's a good bet that you will like tomorrow. Down to the tropics we go. Hurricane Milton still maximum sustained winds of 150 miles per hour. That's a very strong category for storm and this storm ends up making a run at the peninsula of Florida around the Tampa Bay area sometime late tomorrow into very early Thursday as a major category three storm before then dipping over central Florida back into the open waters of the Atlantic. So here through the Delaware Valley, we have no impact directly from this storm whatsoever. Your exclusive AccuWeather seven day forecast 70 today. Same thing tomorrow. Mid 60s, though, is it's the coolest day of the week.